Hi, I'm Bobby Bray. <laughs> and I'm Justin Pearson. Tonight we're playing a show that is the first non-festival show that we've ever played in five years. We aren't actually playing any new songs, so we are kind of like where we were five years ago in terms of the songs that we're playing. As people, we have done many things in five years. Each one of us individually has started probably like three or four bands on average per person. And so, and we've certainly um, adjusted to the universe uh, in, the, in that regard. We have jobs. For one, I, I, I write for uh, San Diego Reader occasionally. Um, I work at a venue as the sound engineer, the Whistle Stop, and play in other bands, uh, well, mostly one other band, Innards. Um, but uh, generally speaking, oh, and I teach at the Art Institute of San Diego, California. Um, generally speaking, my aim is to help the evolution of the collective unconsciousness in any way I possibly can. So if it means infiltrating institutions and then being like a Trojan horse and like unleashing crazy cosmic grenades uh, for social change in very strange ways, then that's what I want to do. Um, and that's kind of my mission statement in life. I trip out on things, you know, like, um, I don't know, like, a good reference point, I think, uh, in current times would be Lady Gaga. You know, I feel like um, I feel like she's artistically kind of pushed boundaries. So I think, like, an aspect of, of what she does that is considered offensive and there's all this, like, sort of, like, side social circus shit that follows what she does seems, like, a little bit more um, calculated than, like, say, like, what Miley Cyrus does. Um, it's, it seems a little bit more punctual and a little bit more um, choreographed. And I feel like... Um, I don't really like her music at all, but I really appreciate what she is, I, I suppose. But my mind wants to know exactly what she is, not like what their producers are telling her she should do or what someone is saying, like, this is this is the element that you have to create to sell. I want to know, like, you know, as her as a supporter, a supporter of, the, of, the, of the gay and lesbian community, like, what does she really think about that? Like, you know, like, or, or like, even like her art, um, as, as challenging, I think, like, mainstream society, like, d could it be, like, way more crazier? I want to know, like, w how she really thinks. So so I start questioning, like, the sincerity of even something uh, at that level, you know? I mean, it, it is good that it exists, I, I, I suppose, on some levels, but I want to know, like, is it really her? Or is it, like, ten producers and someone curating this stuff? I mean, it's, it's all comes back to, like, a matter of opinion. I mean, I think, like, part of the thing, like, with The Locust, I mean, we would always get this weird... We had this weird backlash where people were always heckling us and commenting on the way we dressed and stuff, and so by default we ended up wearing these uniforms. And it wasn't, you know, like it wasn't like um, it wasn't like a, 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 a conscious reaction. It was like it was like a subconscious reaction. It kind of just happened, and then we were like, "Oh shit, we did this." We can do whatever we want and however we want, and as long as we are doing it from our hearts, that's all that really matters.